Hello everybody, welcome to Vlogmas day 22. We are in the final days of Vlogmas and I'm getting more excited as these days approach. I am actually just picking up the camera and it's already going on the afternoon. I've had a really busy morning so Danielle and I had a lovely evening last night. We actually stayed out pretty late. We enjoyed some wine, some good charcuterie, some really good conversation, and just time together, and we exchanged gifts. I'll actually show you what she got me because it was so thoughtful. And yeah, we got home late. I slept in a little bit today. Got up, worked out, did all the things. Ran a couple errands that I needed to. I'm having issues with my right eye. It is possible that there are two contacts in it right now. So I put a contact in this morning and I yanked it out because it hurt so bad. And then I put another one in and it felt funny and I was messing around with it and I couldn't find it and my sight was still blurry. And I looked everywhere for it in my eyeball. I couldn't find it. So I went ahead and put another one in. I can see clearly now, but my eyes been watering. It feels kind of funny. So there is a high chance that I have two contacts in my right eye, which would not be the first time and probably not the last time that that has happened. But I'm going to go ahead and show you what Danielle got me because it's so cute. She had this big box, which the box itself is adorable. And she decided to stick with a theme of relaxation and calm. So she got me a calendar for my office at work everyday calm. I cannot wait to use it. It's 365 days of inspiration and mindfulness to reset, refresh, and live better. She got me a bunch of different masks, sleeping masks, peel-off masks, um, detox, purifying, and they have such great names like maple spiced pumpkin, cranberry orange. They sound amazing. Then she got me start with a dot journal for making your mark. I love the story, the dot. So she got me a journal that went with it. A really cute card. I call her wifey, she calls me Gubby. That's just our nicknames for each other. And then she got me an adorable, adorable t-shirt. And it says, watch all the movies, bake all the things. So cute, I love it. And then she also got me this coffee mug that says pour yourself a cup of ambition XO Dolly, which is just so cute. And you always could use another mug. And then lastly, she got me this migraine sleep mask that you heat up, super cool. But I love this idea of like relaxation and calm. Really, really cute. Love it, love it so much. And then I have to recommend this wine to all of you. So amazing. It's called Arrowwood Propriety Red Blend. Highly recommended. It is delicious. It is a new favorite. You guys are always asking. I actually picked it up yesterday, um, but it is very, very good. This morning I had an overflow of gifts that I needed to wrap. So I went ahead and wrapped all those up. I also went to this new little bookstore called Book Culture, and I picked up this book. It sounds amazing. It's called Beast of a Little Land. That's going to be a read coming up. What else is going on? I got some stock for chicken. I got some Brussels sprouts happening over here. I think I'm gonna cut those up this evening for dinner. Yeah, things are happening. Steven is doing laundry. He's home today, but he is upstairs currently. He had a Zoom a little bit ago, him and Bubba's were on it. But yeah, it's a morning. It's deceitfully cold outside. It looks so sunny and bright, but it's actually like 27 degrees. Here comes Steven. Hi. I told them you and Bubba's had a Zoom today. Oh, we did, yes. He was in his, his Christmas sweater. Oh, he did wear his Christmas sweater for the Zoom? Yeah, so I put him in the Christmas sweater and everyone thought he was well, uh, he was well att attired for the court appearance. I'm so proud of him. You know, was he moody? No, no, he's, it was, it was early morning, so he's never moody in the morning. Are you heading to the Serengeti later? I love you in a monochromatic look. It's very Kim Kardashian. 
She loves a nude, monochromatic, khaki, camel look. Oh yeah, because we're so similar. You are the Kardashian of upstate New York. Well, you know what? I'm Actually, I am. I, I do have a law degree, which is what she Oh, that's quite. true. So, you know, maybe I'll help Jen Shaw uh, beat her case. Because if she's hiring him, I guess I'm the next best thing. You are. All right, I am going to relax a little bit, clean some things up. Things are a little bit messy and all over and just need put away. I know you're looking at this and you're like, that's not messy. This is messy for me. So just some things need to get put away. And I also need to throw in some laundry as well. I have been meaning to show you this. For anyone who has to take daily medicine, this is one of the coolest, hi. He's following me around the house. This is one of the coolest things I found and I leave it out on my counter and visually it helps remind me of taking my medicine each day and each night and really, really helpful. So I labeled them by the month. There's 32, which is totally fine. My need for them to all have a sticker. I use the 30 second sticker, but you just pull it out and it has a place for morning and a place for evening. What's great is if I'm ever traveling, I can just grab the dates that I'm gone for and I have all my medicine with me. But having it out here on the counter has made a huge difference. It's so handy. I'll leave it linked below. I got mine on Amazon, super reasonable, but so great. Christopher, it looks like you just woke up. It's because I did. I started watching Emily in Paris. Before you judge it, and I've heard all the negative things about it, I love season one. I loved the clothes, I loved how silly it was, I loved the storyline. It was like low lift TV. <laughs> um, so I started watching season two, and I fell asleep, completely asleep, for probably a good hour and a half. So, here we are. Steven is in the background. I'm gonna start making dinner shortly, but I thought we'd go ahead and open advent calendars. How is it even possible? Oh wait, no, today's 22. Milk wash exfoliating jelly cleanser. There are some really exciting products in here. 22. Shimmering body oil. I will never ever use that. Jasmine and green tea hand cream. Did you just eat dinner? Did you just eat dinner? Was it delicious? Was it delicious? None of these are yours. We'll open yours in a little bit. Okay. It's not yours. We got a goji orange candle. It's See? He thinks every advent calendar is his. 22 is Duchess. I mean, if that isn't a Duchess, I don't know what is. Pour some sugar on me. In the name of love, pour some sugar on me. Baby Wells. Hmm. I don't know. This calendar's got me working nine to five and I ain't happy. I'm so, well, maybe the problem was nobody was working nine to five on this one. Ugh. Do we even have to do it? Have a holly dolly Christmas. It's the dumbest time of the year. I don't know if there'll be anything in the box, but I'd bet a paycheck for a year that nothing will be there. Oh my goodness, this is literally the worst thing ever. I mean, I'd rather watch Rhinestone Cowboy on loop for 48 hours straight 
and have to open another one of these doors. For those of you not familiar, Rhinestone Cowboy is Sylvester Stallone in a Dolly Parton movie. It is, I love Dolly, but it's a terrible movie. I'd rather watch it on loop than open that calendar. Oi, 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 oi. Let me turn on some lights. It's very dark. I'll tell you what I want, what I really, really want. So tell me what you want, what you really, really want. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna really, really, really wanna zig a zig. Ah, that is a okay that that one is empty because I know that I'm storing it sitting up and those spices have been amazing and I had two come through that door earlier. So that's all right. Are you as disappointed in the Dolly Parton calendar as I am? Yeah. It's not good, Bubby. It's not good. I can tell you that. It is not good. How was dinner? How was dinner? Same thing every day. Did you complain to the cook? What? What do you want? Oh, you want your advent calendar. That's exactly what he wants. Yes, Daddy, if you can have it. Yes, you can have it. All right, let's go. Is this what you want? Is this what you want? Is this what you want? Do you want some? Okay. Let's see, day 22. I see you, I see you, I'm looking, I'm looking. Oh. Happy day 22. Oh my goodness, the snow is really coming down. I want you all to see it. Look at this. <gasps> oh, I love it. It's already covering the ground. This. <laughs> I know many people don't love this weather. I love it. Pretty. All right, my feet are freezing. All right, for David's tea today, we have... You need to also open 21. 21 and, wait, 20, 21, and 22. 21's missing. Wait, did you do it yesterday? Today, we might have done it yesterday. I can't remember. So you still owe 20 and 22. Okay. Uh, sleigh ride. They he have... loves a sleigh ride. I just slay all day. And Santa's secret. It looks like there's candy, little tiny little candy canes. In I'll tell you Santa's secret, you're not getting a gift. Uh, look at him. Santa's secret. Oh, here we go. Uh, Black tea, peppermint, sprinkles, Ugh. Um, rice flour, uh, a bunch of other stuff. And then sleigh ride. Apple, candy pineapple, hibiscus, papaya, beetroot, cinnamon, raisins, coconut rasps, roasted almonds, and rice. Tea for two. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Do you so. have any tea to spill today? Uh, no, it's been a, a very calm and quiet day. It has been a very calm and quiet day. Bubba, do you have any tea to spill? He went to the park and uh, we hiked for a mile and a third. That's a good walk for someone that old. Yeah, it's usual. We usually do it between a quarter, mile and a quarter and a mile and a third. Anything over a mile and a half and he starts getting tired and cranky. Oh. He's taking a drink. And this is our life. 
I just poured a glass of the Arrowhead. Steven hasn't tried it yet, but he'll have to. This is old stuff. A delicious pre-Christmas dinner. Here, taste my. It is cold. How much was it? Like $40. Yeah. Okay. It's nice and smooth. Yeah, it is nice and smooth. Yeah, I made like a little pre-Christmas dinner tonight. It was nothing fancy. It was actually pretty easy to throw together. I roasted a turkey breast. There was a little bit of pan gravy, some mashed potatoes, green beans, and then just like a prepared stuffing. Nothing fancy. Bubby is going to have a little plate of Thanksgiving Christmas dinner. We'll give him the rest of the turkey and cut it up. We are. Why not? I guess we could. You deserve some turkey breast, right? He already ate. So that's what's going on. Tomorrow is going to be the busiest day of Vlogmas. Would you agree, babe? Yes. Steven and I have some plans for tomorrow and it is going to be a busy, busy day. He has plans too. The vlog will probably get to you later than usual. Yeah. Because we're just gonna have a busy day. An exciting day. And I cannot wait to share it with you. But I'm gonna wrap this up and end it like I end all of them. Take care of yourself, take care of others. Be kind, kindness is free. Give it to everyone. Until next time, which will be tomorrow. And it's gonna be worth tuning in. Bye-bye.